Welcome to the amazing KTTV channel. Another video of building RC excavator. This is a um, Heiner 580 to modify the arm, make it longer and skinnier. Also building oil tank. Doesn't look that good, but this will do. An RC excavator hydraulic. All right, let me put it all together and I'll. Um, Let's see how to work. Well, before I put it all together, I want to show you the arm that I did. Uh, make it skinnier. I like it when it's skinnier. I don't like the Heiner arm uh, looking so big. Um, and a whole lot longer. Look at that. Look at the arm I did. Well, I still keep this one. It's uh, the original arm. Um, small arm. But uh, I cut it up a little bit and make it a little bit skinnier you can tell by the size there you go and then i also drilled the hole right there for the uh, the hydraulic pipe to uh, come out from the inside it's run it will run it will run from here and run in there and then come out from right there to right there now I also build a um, a bracket for the the uh, the cylinder. All right, let me put it all together and then do some test. All right. See, so I have to take off the uh, the arm stand so that I have more space to work with. Uh, I put on the uh, the valve and uh, also the uh, motor pump uh, for the uh, Heina. The body is is very small, so space is very limited. So try to get much space in there as possible, and maybe somehow try to fire small battery so that it can fit in the body um, come here I show you uh, what I did here it is oil tank keep it in the back motor pump right here make sure the spin is free zone space zone the valve Tight. Make sure they're tight. I screwed them in right there. You can see. There you go. I have one here. Then on this side. Get this out of the place. This side right there. Right there. Another screw right there. Right here. See. The space right here so that the cap can go in. There you go. Look at that. That's a plenty of space right there. 